Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Scarlett with Scarlett's Little Crafty Corner and today I have got a Diamond Art Club unboxing for you. Now, it's been a month of Sundays since I have had a Diamond Art Club unboxing. Um, but what happened was um, I have an old kit if you are following me i've got an old kit and i'm having issues with some of the drills and i had mentioned it in a video and i had several people say something to me about i should contact dac let them know that i'm having issues with the drills they'd replace the drills so i did well, instead of them replacing the drills, what they did, long story short, there was a bunch of going back and forth between me and DAC support, is I ended up getting a, um, because Betsy Lynn is no longer in, um, they no longer carry it on the DAC website, they couldn't, um, well, Long story short, they gave me a $25 uh, gift card. And so, I have put myself on a no-buy this year for uh, DAC, which it's not like I buy a lot from them anyway. But every once in a while, I would splurge and get one if I seen one I liked. Um, but... It's been a while, y'all, and I mean a long while. I think the last time I purchased something from DAC was back in April, and it was like the tree frogs. Um, but I ended up getting this kit so I could use my gift card because I wasn't sure if it had a, an expiration date or anything. Anyway, so I got this kit. So what I got was dogs are cool and it is a round and it is from tom wood and it is a 20 by 28 inch or 50.7 centimeters by 70.6 centimeters so we're going to open this up and we're going to look at it so um i guess i should say on the back of the box, it does show how to diamond paint. It'll show you all your kit contents. Um, and then it has a QR code on there. It, on the front, it has the picture. And this is just what the box looks like. And if you're familiar with Diamond Art Club, you know that if you have a pink circle, it's going to be around. If you have a blue square, um, it'll be a square kit. And that just means that the, the drills are round or the drills are square. And maybe I can get into this. Maybe I need to get my box cutter. Nope. Yep. Nope. Nope. I got it. Okay. So, I don't... I've had this kit sitting over here for... God, I don't know, probably two months, and I have not even looked at it, and I'm just now doing this video because I've just been busy, and I've had so many things going on, um, but like I said, um, I don't know when this kit came out, it's not a new kit, it's an older kit. Not real old, but it is an older kit. So you've got the tool kit. Then we've got all. Yeah, we've got the sticker. Let me set this over, the box over to the side. So there's the sticker. But I thought this was cute. And at the time, this was within my price range with using my um gift card so let's look at the tool kit see what we got in here 
Y'all haven't done an unboxing for Diamond Art Club in so long. So, first off, we've got a purple pin with a purple squishy. We've got a heart-shaped caddy, and it has two hearts of wax. I'm fixing to drop it. Let me stick all this back in there. Like I said, I have not done an unboxing for DAC in so long. We've got a bag of baggies. You get, if I can pick it up here, you get the good placers. You've got a seven placer and a four placer. And everybody that knows me knows that I love the four placers. You get a white tray with a spout and a stopper so that's good and then you get a random thing of washi tape and a random what is that a random cover minder i'm not real sure what that is i'm not sure what that is i'm i'm sure it's a fruit but i don't know what it is so that's what you get in the tool kits. And then, of course, like I said, you get your little sticker, which I put these in my um, my book that I keep. I know a lot of people put them on the ends of the boxes or whatnot, but I put mine on my, or in my book. And on my Diamond Art Clubs, I always take, if I'm not going to be working on them, I always put them back in the plastic and then I put them back into the box. But it does come in a plastic dust sleeve that says Diamond Art Club. Do what makes you sparkle, which I'll put this over here. It does have the very soft, velvety filling back. And oh my gosh, look at that. Are they not cute? It comes with the big sticker. Okay, that's weird. Okay, I'm like, um, <laughs> it's not 78. Okay, so it comes with 78 drills. So this has got two stickers. That's cool. Um, and like I said, it is by Tom Wood. It has a start date, end date. Um, it is a round. And it looks like we have got one, two, three ABs. And then we're going to have some specials. Let's see. We've got one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so this is the first kit I have ever gotten that has something other than ab drills y'all so this is all new to me all right so you get your instruction book with your um, dac kits and all this is is you get a thank you um it tells you how to diamond paint you scan that, you can watch a video, tells you how to do it. Scan that, and you can go into the Facebook, the VIP Facebook group, your step-by-step -step instructions. It tells you your kit contents, and it just shows you some tips and tricks. And, yeah. So, there's that, and then here are the drills, which we will look at here in just a second. So, this will flatten out by itself. Itself. And as you can see, it is absolutely gorgeous. And I'm going to bring y'all up just a little, maybe. Let's see. I know my lighting is not very good. It's late at night here. So up at the top, it's going to say, Do What Makes You Sparkle Diamond Art Club. We have got a schematic on the left and on the right. It's going to have, like I said, 78 colors. It's going to show you the DMC 
numbers are going to be charted and then it's going to show you all the symbols letters numbers all that good stuff down on the bottom you're going to have a thumbnail and then you're going to have your dogs are cool which is the name of the canvas it's going to have your measurements there's the um the name of the artist and then all the info diamond art club is going to have your take 10 which is a 10% um, off your next purchase their facebook instagram your guarantee and their um support in case you need it but look at this i know y'all can't see everything what would make this even better is if they had a boston terrier on here <laughs> Y'all knew I was going to say that. But look at how clear. So clear. You know it's going to be good and sticky. Okay, let's. I'm going to bring it down just a little. Y'all, my light. Ugh. All right, let's see what all this is. I am curious. Because like I said, I have not bought a new canvas in so long that I've not gotten any that had the new new drills and stuff and because I like I said I know the last canvas I got was the tree frogs and I think they had just ABs I don't think they had anything special alright let's see let's see so we've just got I'm just going to slide through these see the first one all right so there's the 107 is that not pretty oh my gosh and y'all I have not ever seen a fairy dust so not up in close and personal I've seen others show them see there's the 100 so that is that's pretty so there's one strand and then that one y'all seen that was out by itself I think these yeah I'm trying to see these as I'm showing them to y'all there's some hitchhikers in that one I hope y'all can see these colors because like I said my lighting is not very good and it is 7.30, after 7.30 at night. Only one bag of 310s. How awesome. I'm not used to that either. And look, y'all, the one that I'm working on right now, Betsy Lynn. Oh, my God. I think there are, I forgot how many bags of 310s there is. I think it's like, there's more than 20. I think. I don't really remember. She's been laying over there for a while. I've not even touched her. And then, let's see. But I've seen this one, and I've had it on my wish list ever since I've seen it come out. And then when I got all this, or when I was dealing with them, oh my gosh, there's like hardly nothing in those bags. But when I was dealing, going back and forth with customer service, I was just like, you know what, this would be a good opportunity to go ahead and just get that diamond painting. So I did. Okay, so here is, here's one, the Z3689. So, okay, I guess that's what that is, is fairy dust. Um, okay, pretty, but from here it's, okay, and then here's another one, the 3855, 
so it's just got a little bit of glitter on it so it's y'all i'm sorry but i just thought it would be something <laughs> i just thought it would be a little bit more blingy i guess i don't know well when you hear like fairy dust is that what this is, is fairy dust i don't know i just thought it would be more i don't know am i sounding horrible Okay, so here is K44. Now, see, now that is neat. And then we have K318. And then we have another of the Z3766. Okay, so we're going to look and see. Oh, oops. Okay, and then we have the 105. Y'all, I'm sorry. But I'm going to have to say that I think the ABs are prettier. And, and I'm not, I don't know. Maybe once I get them out of the package and put them on here, maybe they'll look different to me. Maybe it's just because it's dark in here. And I'm looking at them through plastic. I don't know, but they just don't. They're not doing nothing for me. Not in the plastic. I don't know. Okay. Well, let's just see where they go. So, okay. Let's see. So, it's showing that... We'll just start with this one because it's, we'll start with this one because it's right here. So, the K318 is U. So, U, oh, I might have to sit down because I can't see. Um, let's see, where would the U's be? I would have think maybe... Um, hmm, are they up here? Are y'all seeing it and y'all are yelling at me going, they're right there. Y'all, I'm blind as a, oh, I see the U's. They're right here. So, this, this blingy is going to be right here in his sunglasses. Well, that's cute. Okay. And then the Z is going to be this. And you know this is going to be over here. Yep. This. Let's see. This one is right here. And then it's going to be right here. Um, I think that's, that's going to be it. Is there any up there? No. I think that's all for that one. And then the K44 is C. Okay. So, the C. C is going to go right here in this one, sunglasses. Um, it's going to go in the necklace right here. And around the bone. Let's, let's see if it's going to go up here anywhere. Mm. No. Okay, and then where did the other one go? This one is the Z38, which is the little wavy lines. Again, in the sunglasses over here. Um, we got it in the bone again. Uh, maybe, yeah, it's going to be in the dog food bowl. Um, 
It's going to be over here in the ball, which I didn't even notice that until just now. Okay. And then we have the pink one. And it is the lowercase a, which is going to be in her little sunglasses and in her sweater, just sprinkled in the sweater. So that's going to be cute. Is it going to be up there? No. Let's see. That's all of that. All right. And I'll put that one over there. All right. So 105. I think that was all of those. Yeah. All right. So the ABs. 105 is two. So number twos. So I'm sure this is going to be scattered. Yeah. Because there is twos down here in her feet. There are some twos. Let's see. Is there any in the dog food? No. So we have twos in the dog's feet. We have got some twos up here in her ear line. We have got, let's see, we got some right here and spikes hair or fur right up in there. And do we have any up here? Yeah, we've got twos in his ears. So that's going to be cute. All right. So that's all of that one. And then what did I say? All right. So we need to find those other ones. Where did they go? Ooh, where did it go? Where did it go? All right. Here's 106. Seven. So you know this has got to go over here because he hasn't had anything yet. So yeah. So this one is just scattered throughout his sweater and the bandana over here. So that's that one. And then here's Here's the green. So that one is number one. And that will be the last one we look for. So let's see. That's going to be scattered around up here in the trees. So that's, that's going to be pretty. I can't wait to do this one, y'all. I can't. So what do y'all think about this one? Has anybody got this? I've honestly, I mean, I don't watch everybody's, you know, the big, big channels anymore. Um, I've kind of gotten away from the bigger channels and I just watch all of our small channels now, but I know I'm sideways, y'all. I'm trying to get the whole kit in here so y'all can see it. So what do y'all think? I have not seen anybody unkit this, is what I was trying to say. And I just might not have seen it because, like I said, I do not watch the great big huge channels anymore. Like, you know, the big name people. I just, I just don't watch them no more. So, I've not seen this one unkitted. Or unboxed is what I'm trying to say. So I don't know if there's anything that I'm missing. But I thought it was cute. And I mean, it's rendered great. 
Dogs Club, Cats Keep Out, says dogs are cool, and then his little thing says Spike. But it's nicely rendered. So, so yeah, I think it's so cute. But like I said, I just wish it had a, like a Boston Terrier in it. <laughs> so, so yeah. So what do y'all think about this one? I love it. Absolutely love it. But I wanted to get it unboxed so that I could get it put up. Because, y'all, I've got so much stuff. I cleaned my craft room, sorted it, cleaned it, and now it looks like a bomb has hit it. So, I'm trying to get everything back and organized. And I'm like, gosh, I need to get this put on video so I can get this put up. But I think this might be the next one I do as soon as I can get Betsy Lynn done. Because I, I can't put one up. Once I start it, I, I have to finish it. I can't just put it up in a corner somewhere. I have to finish it or it will bug me. So, once I get this craft room reorganized, then I'm fixing to hit Betsy Lynn with a vengeance. I'm not going to do nothing else but Betsy Lynn until I get her butt done. And <clears throat> then... <clears throat> Then I'm just gonna be, I'm gonna be done with her, and then I'm gonna try to get something else done. So, all right, y'all. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'm going to get this put up, and yeah. So, all right. Please do all the YouTube -y things: uh, like, subscribe, comment, and I appreciate each and every one of you. And until my next video, I will see you all later. Bye, y'all.